So this is just a quick video of uh, hopefully showing you a way of how you can increase your frames per second on LA Noir and um, get rid of some of these stuttering issues which can occur if you're using you know, a modern CPU with a lot of threads and a lot of cores. Um, the problem seems to be related to you know, modern CPUs that have a lot of threads and cores that um, you know, the game wasn't really originally designed around. So when you're trying to run the game off a, a setting, uh, by default it's multi-core, so running it from that um, seems to be causing issues. Um, so this is a way that, that I've found to get rid of that problem and to run the game at pretty much a locked 30 oh. frames a second. So what you need to do is to go into your documents folder, go to then uh, Rockstar Games directory, and then go to LA Noir directory folder. Uh, and then what you want to do is you see the settings to INI. Um, what I'd recommend that you do is if you make a copy of this, just in case something goes wrong, just name it as uh, you know copy or old or whatever you want to call it, so that um, you have it safe there in case something goes wrong. So then what you want to do is just, just to open this um, file in uh, text editor, any kind of editor doesn't really matter. Um, and the main thing that you want to change here is where it says threading. You want to change this to where it says multi. Uh, or multiple cores and change that to single so you just have to make sure that you're using a capital S there uh, for single and then what you want to do is to save this uh, so you know just save save your file uh, and then you can get rid of that and then what you want to do is to make sure that this isn't overridden you want to right click and go to properties and make sure it's under read only uh, and apply that and then press OK so this hopefully should should um, you know fix the issue uh, and give you a stable 30 frames a second. You know, it's not going to give you 60 frames because the game isn't designed around that. There's other ways of doing that. That's not really what this is about. Um, we just want to get a stable frame rate and make sure that the game is playable. Um, so, another way that I've found of getting this to work is if this if this method isn't working for you, uh, you know, if you change if you don't change any of the INI settings, what you can do is uh, go to your task manager. Uh, and then go to details, try and find LA Noir here. Yeah, it says LA Noir.exe. So you have to make sure the game is running while you're doing this. Uh, and then right click and then go to set priority, and then you will set that to high. Uh, and the second thing that you want to do is set affinity. Uh, and what you want to do is deselect CPU 0 and CPU 1, and that will mean that these other cores are then being utilized properly, which the game isn't doing by default. Uh, and then you press OK, and then once you go back to the game, it should mean that it's running using the multi-core process, uh, you know, properly. So doing either one of these should should work for you if you're using a modern CPU, or at least it worked for me, and hopefully it's working for for you as well. Um, yeah. So another thing about this this method is that you need to do this every single time the game is running. Uh, and the first the first method, uh, you don't need to do that. You just need to change the setting, and then that's it. So, you know, those are two different ways of doing it. Um, hopefully, one of these is working for you. 